Hey everybody, welcome to another edition of the J and J Toy Giants YouTube channel, Toy Unboxing. I am your host JD, and uh, yeah, Jaden's over there uh, playing in his pool with his mom, cooling off. It's very hot uh, today, and it's a lot sunnier than the other videos that I was out here doing some toy unboxings. But today, I'm going to be doing some more toy unboxings of WWE Elite uh, Velveteen Dream Series 67 and the fan. Take over Adam Cole with the NXT Championship. So let's do like we always do. Let let's breathe. let them breathe. All right, so the very first one I'm going to go over with you today is the Velveteen Dream from NXT. And uh, if you're an avid wrestling fan, you know... Recently, within the last month, uh, Velveteen Dream was released. It's actually what prompted me to actually get his figure because I've been wanting to get him. Those are his first elite, uh, I believe, that came out uh, for WWE. And so this is, uh, he, he was kind of like the version of Prince for the WWE. And that's why he kind of has like the Prince glasses. He's got like the purple ring type uh, get up here. Uh, for those of you that, who don't know who Prince is for the younger generation, uh, YouTube him. You're not gonna, you're not gonna be sad that you haven't, because this guy was an awesome, awesome performer. But uh, the Velveteen Dream was, or was actually um, in the Tough Enough series back in, I believe, 2008, if not. But I remember he was in the reality show Tough Enough, which was kind of like for the uh, for those who don't know who Tough Enough is, because uh, I remember the original one when Maven was the uh, the winner. But Tough Enough was kind of like the American Idol or the voice of like trying to be a wrestler, where people would try out to be a wrestler. They would go through um, you know different type of drills and learn the moves and trying to take bumps, and they would actually be trained by WWF wrestlers or coaches who know how to wrestle and um, so that's pretty much what and I remember the last time that they did Tough Enough which I believe I, was it Stone Cold Steve Austin or Stone Cold Steve Austin was the trainer and Jericho was the, the judge um, and so they but the Velveteen Dream was on there as well so the head sculpt on this is pretty cool um, or pretty good rather so you can see right there his glasses are Removable, just like Montez Ford and Bianca Belair. Um, but I like this. This is a pretty cool figure. A lot of my friends are kind of mad at me that I'm actually letting him breathe because this is going to be worth a lot. I'm surprised it hasn't jumped in um, pricing already because he was recently released. But I like it. He's had many iterations uh, since this particular one. But... Um, the other ones, I think the last one that came out was he was in like a baby blue clouded, like it almost kind of looked like the background of Toy Story in, um, in Andy's room where you see the clouds. He had like this jumpsuit and it had clouds all over it. I'll, I'll leave a, a picture right over here so you can see uh, his most recent leak. Um, and of course he's had basics with like was a uh, battle pack with Rick Ricochet where he had his uh, Hulk Hogan get up so you can see... Um, you can see that one up here as well. But, um, yeah, I mean, this was his very first one. I like it a lot. And just because of the Prince um, image that he was trying to, like, portray here. And he was a very, very unique individual. Very good wrestler. And the I actually had this outside a little bit. So his joints were really loose because it's really hot outside. So, but I'm sure when he, when I get him back inside and it gets cooled up, you know, cool enough a little bit and he'll start getting a little tighter then. But, um, oh, there we go. So you can see the, the joints are really low, so it's hard for him to stand. But I'm going to be putting him in on my future endeavors NXT ring when I get that set up. So if anyone who actually knows uh, where I can get a basic uh, NXT ring or possibly I might have to just get like a regular um, SmackDown or Raw ring and just get an NXT decal, that would probably be the best way to do it as well. So let's go to the next one. Yes, the next one that we're going to be going over with you today in this unboxing is the former leader of the Undisputed Era. Yes, Adam Cole, baby. And um, this is part of the Fans Takeover series 
which I actually became a really good fan of. There's actually a part of the new one that I want, the uh, Johnny Gargano, uh, the X-Pac. Also, I wanted to get the, uh, which was the other one that I wanted, uh, the Shayna Baszler that has the NXT Women's Championship title in there as well. And um, so this is kind of outdated already because the Undisputed Era is no longer together. They were a faction of young wrestlers that uh, were in NXT and Adam Cole, as you probably know, if you're an avid fan of uh, wrestling, Adam Cole was a very, and uh, still is a very good wrestler, but in the Indies, he was like one of the biggest stars in the independent wrestling that was out there. And then he finally came to the WWE. Uh, so Adam Cole uh, recently was, I guess, disbanded the group. And of course, obviously, if you've been watching NXT, you know that that uh, recently just happened, and we saw that kind of coming after a while. They they could have they've been together for at least I think two years now. They've been together as a group, and so they they finally thought, you know figured out that at some point something's got to give, and they, they in order to be able to become better as far as like performers, they needed to split up. And I know um, Kyle O'Reilly was starting to become a lot more popular. And you know, a lot of fans were really wanting him to get push in wrestling, so they finally decided to split them up. But this is the most recent iteration of um, Adam Cole and Gold Bay Bay Gold. Is what he has on his shirt. And I believe this is removable. It is. But I'm just going to leave it there for right now. But I, from what I've seen, I mean, obviously uh, Adam Cole was a former United States champion. I'm sorry, North American champion from NXT, also former, I believe, two-time NXT champion as well. And I have to check my facts there. And is currently in the hunt on a fatal five-way uh, coming up in the NXT in your house, uh, you know, pay-per-view that they're gonna be doing. I think they're gonna be doing live on television. I haven't been keeping up uh, with wrestling that much uh, recently because I've been so busy with work and obviously with the channel. But, uh, you know, you can correct me if, in the comments if, you, if it's going to be an actual pay-per-view on the Peacock Network or um, if it's going to be on live TV on USA. But I know In Your House is the next pay-per-view that they're doing, that they're going to be um, doing the pay-per-view, and it's going to be Fatal Five Way with Karen Cross, uh, Kyle O'Reilly, Adam Cole, uh, Pete Dunne, and uh, Karen Cross, Adam Cole, Pete Dunne, Kyle O'Reilly and Johnny Gargano. So <clears throat> this the, the actual head sculpt is pretty good. And they made him look a little bit more bulkier or buff, you know, because he's a small guy. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. He's a small dude, but he can wrestle. Um, the tattoo is pretty spot on. And the uh Bebe face that they have is pretty good. And you know, like I said, that these, uh, for not that many people know how these toys work or when they come out, they usually come out about a year or basically start being made about a year prior to when they actually come out, possibly six months if they're rushing it. And so a lot of times you may not get like a, a recent iteration of, or depicting of the specific uh, wrestler, depending on like if their face or if their heel at the times, you know, vice versa. So this was the most recent iteration and they decided to do a fan takeover, um, you know, line, but it's pretty much a, a, an elite, no matter what. But uh, it's really good. I'm, I'm definitely going to be uh, adding this over to my NXT section that I'm starting to build. Uh, I had a basic of him, but I gave it to Jaden since I'm trying to replace, slowly but surely trying to replace all of my basics with uh, elites and I already have the Bobby Fish and Kyle O'Reilly. Um, already so all right so that does it be with you in a second so uh definitely uh when i've heard that velveteen dream was released uh definitely wanted to get him added to my collection and uh you know start like my own nxt uh current roster and you know uh future endeavor roster and then of course i've always wanted to get uh adam cole to put in my nxt collection as well and i needed that um nxt uh, heavyweight title because I also have Karrion Cross, who is the current, right now, this recording, current NXT champion, which I'm going to be doing a, um, you know, unboxing soon for him. 
be sure to check that out. Que onda, si pecho arriba, las manos, gabacho, moreno,